Now, for x squared minus x minus 5 equals 0, um, it's not easy to see the solution here because this trinomial is difficult to factor. So what we're going to do is use the quadratic formula. And our quadratic formula is x equals my, uh, negative b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. And so we have to identify our a, b, and c to sub into our quadratic formula. And from our quadratic equation, so here's our quadratic equation, a is 1, b is negative 1, and c is negative 5. So we sub in, and this is what you should get when you sub in correctly, and simplify, and we end up with, and here I'm going to consider, there's two situations, one where we're adding the square root of the discriminant, and another one where we're subtracting the square root of the discriminant. So when we do this, we end up, if we take the addition situation, we end up with x equals 1 plus the square root of 21 divided by 2. And the question asks for exact uh, solution, so we could um, rewrite this as 1 half plus square root of 21 uh, over 2, or we could just leave it like this. And so this then is the exact answer. Uh, you can simplify this on a calculator, but if you're going to lose marks because the um, question asks for exact values, and which means we don't round it all. So if we consider the subtraction um, situation in calculating our x, we also end up with 1 minus the square root of 1 plus 20, uh, square root of 1 plus 20 over 2. And so then our other x value that we sub in would be 1 minus square root of 21 over 2. And so here, if we subbed these values of x back into the equation, then x squared minus x minus 5 would, equal to, would be equal to 0. And so if you do this and don't round um, on your calculator, then you're going to find that um, if you sub in either of these two values in for x, then x squared minus 5, uh, sorry, x squared minus x minus 5 all comes out to be 0, exactly.